Man, this season was so bad. There's no possible way we'll get any more of this. Actually, that's exactly what we're getting. Hey guys, it's Dan, your host of Dan's Reviews, and today I'm back for another video for The Walking Dead. This one is going to be doing my video review for the DVD and Blu-ray release for Tales of the Walking Dead Season 1. Alright guys, this one's going to be doing another review today. This one's going to be doing another review for The Walking Dead. This one's going to be doing our review for the release of Tales of the Walking Dead Season 1 on DVD. So, um, this is our release for the uh, first season of Tales of the Walking Dead. I really, really didn't want to buy this. I really, really didn't want to give them my money for this <laughs> first season of Tales of the Walking Dead. Because I do not like this season in the slightest. But... I got it, I bought it, and if you couldn't tell by my Instagram post yesterday, um, wasn't too happy about it. No. So, um, yeah, I went to the, uh, the DVD store, I went to, uh, Sun uh, Sunrise Records here in, uh, Canada, and you will not believe the price I paid for this. This is uh, absolutely insane. This cost $40 to buy this damn thing. $40 for six episodes of crap, pretty much. I mean, I like the premiere, I like Terry Crews, but, like, for the most part... It's a bad season. It's literally cannon breaking to The Walking Dead with Alpha. They literally cannon break this whole thing. And the rest of the episodes are absolutely ridiculous. I mean, Gina and Blair, one of the worst episodes of television, if you ask me. Um, you know, Devon, really horrible episode. Um, Dr. Everett, again, not a good episode. The finale is just so dumb. I mean, honestly, this show really is um, one of the worst uh, of this franchise, if not the worst, because at least with the World Beyond, you know what I mean? Like, World Beyond has, you know, redeeming factors like the CRM. This has absolutely no redeeming factors aside from what, like an actor I like, Terry Crews? Like, that's that's it. I mean, honestly, aside from that, I'm just frustrated throughout this whole thing. So, we're going to go through it. We're going to give our thoughts and uh, talk about the season a little bit. So, that'll be that. But, um, I guess I'll get started with the slipcover. So, basically, you got the season one key art right here. Uh, you've got Terry Crews. Um, you've got um, Olivia, uh, or Olivia, or wait a minute. I didn't even put Olivia Munn on this. She's, like, literally one of the greatest characters. She's one of the only characters that's actually good in this. What the frick? Anyway, um, so you got Terry Crews, um, no Olivia Munn, because we can't show all the good characters, and uh, you've got the chick from the finale, again, I don't even remember her name, that's how much I don't care about this, uh, you've got Blair right here, I remember her well, uh, you've got uh, the amazing actor for A-Train from The Boys right here, which he's a phenomenal actor, I don't know what they did with him, uh, you've got the actor that plays Goose in Top Gun, um, and well... Yeah, they, they brought the actor for Goose in this. I'm still not sure why the hell they friggin' did, but uh, yeah, they butchered him. He wasn't good at all. And then you've got Alpha right down here. And it says, um, six different stories, one dead world. One dead show, you mean. And um, back here, you've got uh, the uh, genuinely unexpected from Collider. Collider, I agree, genuinely unexpected. And you've got, uh, yeah, the A-Train actor, you've got a few other photos down here, nothing too major. I uh, got Alpha there and stuff, and uh, if you can see, there are no special features in the back of this. Take a look at this. There is absolutely no special features in this DVD set at all. So, they basically took the episodes, slapped it on this thing, and put this out here for $40. Are you actually serious right now? Like... Every other set of The Walking Dead, whether it be World Beyond, whether it be Fear the Walking Dead, whether it be, um, you know, uh, the main series, of course, there used to be so many special features. And I talk about this every time I do a Walking Dead DVD review, but seriously, guys, seriously, give us some special features. Like, I know this show sucks and you don't want to put special features, I hear you, but what the hell are you making this 40 bucks for? Six crummy episodes, pretty much? Like, no, I, I do not accept that. $40 for one kind of good Terry Crews episode, and then the rest either be cannon-breaking or just not good. I mean, no, no. $40 for that? That is absolutely ridiculous. And I can't even believe that they charged $40 for this. I, I can't even believe that. So, let's get into this. Uh, throw the paper away. Who gives a frick? Um, so, anyway, you've got uh, Tales of the Walking Dead. Here are the discs right here. You've got episodes one through three on disc one. You got like some blood and stuff, uh, which, okay, I mean, the, the discs are pretty good. That's actually the one compliment I can give this thing. Uh, I do like the discs. Uh, you've got some blood splatter here, and this contains episodes four through six. <laughs> That's a bumpy ride. Uh, so, yeah, um, in terms of Tales of the Walking Dead, in terms of what you get for this series, I mean, 
you know, would I recommend this? Not really. I mean, if you don't like the season, I would say don't get this because literally, guys, there is nothing featured in this. There are like, are there even like, hang on a sec, four hours and 25 minutes. That's the amount of episodes, subtitles, all that stuff, widescreen. There's not even audio commentary in this. Are they seriously that lazy? Oh my goodness, guys, this is ridiculous. Like, at least some of the other other recent Walking Dead releases that, you know, don't have, like, you know, a whole bunch of special features these days, which is pretty much all of them. Um, at least they have, like, you know, some audio commentary or something. I mean, yeah, no, there's not even audio commentary. That's how bad this season is. They didn't even care. They're just, like, they just chucked out the episodes and sent it out to your local Walmart. I mean, that is absolutely ridiculous. So, um, it's, I, I mean, I... I don't like the season. I don't like the show. Um, I guess the only positive thing about this release I can say is that it doesn't say the complete first season. So maybe hope that there won't be a second season of this. Um, you know what I mean? I do find that weird that they don't put the complete first season on there. So I don't know, Tales. Maybe you're giving me hope that you'll finally just be done and, you know, not release any more. But uh, speaking of more, we know that there's going to be a show called More Tales of the Walking Dead. So we know that's coming. Um, but... Yeah, in terms of this release, this is an outer fail. I mean, the season's not good. There's no freaking audio commentary. They couldn't even go that far. And, like, no. Like, there's no special features. There's no anything like that. The show itself is bad. Yeah, no. Th this is literally a fail. I don't... I don't. I actually cannot say anything nice about this release. Um, I guess the only thing I can say nice, if I had to try to find something, is that... At least there's a slipcover that comes with this. Recent Walking Dead releases haven't come with slipcovers, so... For some reason, they felt that Tails was the special one to give a slipcover to. Um, but um, yeah, no, that, I literally got nothing else really nice to say. This is a terrible season. This is a fail for the Walking Dead franchise. Um, I can't even believe this was $40. This is absolutely ridiculous that it's 40 bucks to get this in your collection. Like, I'm seriously going to stick this in the back of my shelf and probably never look at it again. And I'm sure a lot of people are going to ask, well, Dan, why did you buy this, right? Well, I'm a completist. I collect everything Walking Dead. I collect everything from the franchise. I review everything from the franchise. So obviously, I was going to to pick this up so it's not out of joy trust me i do not like this season and um i think tails was an utter fail i think they had a chance with tails when the the idea was first pitched to do backstories on walking dead characters um you know maybe throw in the odd new one here and there but that concept wise would be good you know what i mean like, you give us an Abraham episode, maybe you give us a, a Governor episode, you give us an Alpha episode, just make sure it's not canon-breaking, like the one they gave us here, where Beta is clearly forgotten about, and, you know, the whole idea of how Alpha became the Whispers is just such a plot hole. But, um, yeah, no, in terms of this, this is a terrible release. They have amazing actors on this show, like Terry Crews, the actor for uh, Goose from Top Gun, the actor for, um, you know, A-Train from The Boys, and all of them, uh, except for Terry Crews, I would say, got butchered, so... Yeah, um, again, genuinely unexpected, dead on Collider, honestly dead on. So uh, let me know in the comment section below, what do you guys think about Tales of the Walking Dead Season 1? Are you going to be picking up this release or are you going to kind of skip out on it and you're just watching this video to kind of see what's up? Uh, I feel you if, if that is the case. Don't worry, I'll sacrifice the 40 bucks. <laughs> but uh, yeah, eh, whatever, 40 bucks. I mean, I'm not going to complain about it too much, I guess, but... I can't believe they charged that much for this. Like, I'm still going to say, I can't believe they charged 40 bucks for six episodes like this and no, not even like audio commentary. Like they went cheap this time. They seriously did. I paid like, I think it was like $25 for my Fear of the Walking Dead season seven a few months ago. And that thing like had at least like audio commentary. I think it did have like a feature or two or something. Like at least that had something. This has literally absolutely nothing. So yeah, no. Utter fail, utter fail. So anyway, if you're new to the channel, guys, and you enjoy this video, make sure to click that subscribe button so you don't miss any other videos for The Walking Dead and Tales of The Walking Dead. But, uh, make sure, of course, to follow me on Dan's The Walking Dead reviews on Instagram, guys. And of course, I'll see you guys very soon for more Blu-ray and DVD reviews. Enjoy the rest of your day, guys, and peace out.